Hello, Neo here for more Let's Play of Stoneheart with Hardshire here. So uh, what we do, we continue with uh, the first element of Hardshire. And uh, now we are about to promote someone to Mason using the chisel. So without waiting, let's promote this guy to Mason. Let's just check what the caravan has to offer. Nah. No, it's not worth it. We already have a farmer. So now, just like the carpenter, we have to place his workshop. And then you grab uh, a piece of stone, a hunk of stone, to make his own workplace. And now we can craft some new stuff. So the mason basically use stone to craft uh, different uh, stuff for your town. So let's make a stone chair for starters. And uh, he works just like the carpenter, except that he use mostly stone to craft his uh, his stuff. So we can make some uh, furniture made of stone, but also some uh, part for uh, later building that's yet to come, but uh, someday we'll be able to make building ma made with stone. So basically with the uh, mason you in the stone age. So now while they're eating, let's grab some more material. We can collect these flowers here add some decoration but what I want mostly is stone because now that we have a mason we will need the uh, stone as a resource more often so perfect we have some uh, some boulders here and also we might use them uh, for the new buildings we'll make now yeah and for that we need to clear some space. We don't need all these beds now. At least until night time. And we'll start building another little home here. Let's build a cottage. Yeah, we'll do that. And place it somewhere around here. Yeah, that will do. Yeah, of course we need more doors and windows. Might as well make more furniture. And uh, compare with the, the carpenter, the mason, the doesn't have uh, as large array for furniture, but uh, basically can make uh, a stone variant or almost everything. And we have bird bat too, which uh, we're gonna make for the birdies. And these, my friends, is the first occurrence of water, by the way, we will have in the stone heart. Eventually we'll have some lakes and water source and such, but for now we have bird bats. It's a good start. Yeah, why is that it? Let's make more beds. To be sure that uh, everyone has a chance to sleep in one. And a few lanterns, because night time will come. And now since the our cottage is coming along nicely, we might as well begin to put uh, some furniture in it, like beds. Oh, and uh, seems our carpenter leveled up. Oh, 
we have the bird bat ready. So let's place it. It is gonna make uh, some sort of uh, a zen flavor to our settlement. There we go. And tranquil. Oh, we have a goblin stealing our stuff. Dini Shake Ladder. Oh, he's far away in the, the plains. But uh, he's getting some stone there that uh, we, we left behind. Oh, never mind. Let's check uh, the level up. So we have the farmer and the carpenter that leveled up. Let's keep placing some stuff like the lanterns. To put some lighting in the buildings. A table here. In the chair by the window. Let's place a few more beds. Once again, just because we uh, don't have enough building, it's a makeshift bed place. Okay, things are going well. I still have work, uh, some work to do on the cottage, but uh, well, at least for this night they will have, uh, they'll be able to watch the stars as they get to sleep. There's always a good side for a good side for everything. Oh, what's up? Oh, seems the goblin is visiting our town now. right over there making a, a bonfire of his own but if he comes by again we're gonna welcome him okay so let's check the, the stats now things are going well we have a lot of stuff now and uh, if things get uh, still go well we might be able to get uh, a new heartling. Oh, and there comes our goblin. Yeah, he didn't stand a chance. Hmm, what's this? Oh, we got a, a honor token. I guess we get one each time we slay a goblin. I don't know what they're for. I think we can place them for decoration. But uh, they don't seem to have a purpose really. It's more or less a curiosity. It's 
like a trophy of some sort. Well, well, well. So morning is coming. And we better get ready to uh, be sure to have uh, all we need to welcome a new hearting. Yeah, so... I don't know what they're for really, but uh, I think we're gonna need it later. So let's get all these berries again. They've grown back. And now we uh, should have plenty of food. And uh, all the stuff we need to have more people in our town. A bit uh, of flour here to have some flavor to our little cottage I like those flowers they have a nice touch oh finally oh yes 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 we have a new settler let's accept it so we have a new heartling coming in and he'll be able to live with them and work for us so that's what you want the more you have the better it is you never know what uh, profession you will need and such so now let's place uh, the, the furniture we just crafted so we have a, a dining place outside here to accommodate the, all the people we have so they'll be able to eat together here in uh, this type of uh, zen garden with the bird bat nearby and really it's important to have uh, some chairs and table because they, they will eat better and they get more from the food you have so it's more efficient to if you can build chair do that it's almost as important as beds so now we have eight heartlings and uh, some of them will be promoted to professions in the uh, upcoming videos Yeah, so I think that's about it, and uh, now we have a new update co coming soon, and uh, what we plan to do is uh, to continue with uh, Hardshire in some way, and uh, get more and more people and build, and eventually mine in the mountains and such. Oh, let's see what this is about. Cathedral, Archer, or oh, we can manage without them. We need food, really. So yeah, we will explore eventually around and uh, do some mining and stuff. Oh, the hunter, the trapper is getting uh, another level. Eventually, he'll be able to be uh, promoted to the shepherd. But now hopefully he gets some uh, furry little friend that he can pet. So uh, anyway, that's about it. So uh, come back for more and uh, hopefully we'll be with uh, the next update, Alpha 9, with a bunch of new stuff and such. So stay tuned and see ya.